Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you are doing well. I received this question. Someone want to know how to print from laptop to Canon printer. How to print from your laptop to Canon printer. So what you need to do is first of all make sure the, that the printer and the laptop both are connected to the same network. So I'm going to switch the printer on okay and uh, when the printer is ready what you need to do is to print your document then you need to go to you need to go to your file okay so go to the file on your printer on your computer so go this is the file then you need to look for the document you go to the documents select documents and now scroll down to select specific document you want to print out Okay, so this is the document I want to print out. For instance, open it up, select on it, and now this document is okay. This is the document, okay. It's a book that I scan. Okay, now to print this out, what you need to do is you look on top, okay. Just waiting for the printer to be ready. So what you need to do is you look on top, you will see image, okay, of a printer and also image for you to save as. So select printer image or you can select control plus P on your laptop keyboard. Okay, now once you select the print image or printer image you will see this setting printer setting will come up but you need to make sure you select the correct printer so I'm, so go to the printer on top okay to select so go to on top and select the printer you want to use okay and this printer is Canon Pexima MG3650 so what you need to do, you need to scroll down and look for MG3650 and you can see MG3600 series is okay and it's ready. Now what you need to do is you need to select how many copies. Okay, select how many copies. Also select layout. So the number of copies, scroll down to change the number of copies you want to select to. You need to add how many copies you want, okay. Now also layout, you can have it portrait or landscape. At the moment it's in, la it's in portrait. And also then you scroll down as well to select page pages. So you can select odd page only or even page only, which is odd page, either page one, three, five, or even page like two, four, six. So you can actually select or you can select the specific page okay you can also select all now the next thing to do is you select the color and select the color is the next you can have it colored or black and white you can also print on the both side you can select print on both side so that this print document will print on the both side once you've done that the next thing you need to do is select print Okay, and you can see the document is now printing
Okay, you can see we are printing this on both sides, so it's going to go back inside. So this is the document we printed out black and white on both sides. Now the other thing I want to show you is another way to print this document is for you to okay another way to you can also print this document single page okay instead of printing it on both sides what you need to do is select print again select print instead of selecting so instead of selecting on both sides you just need to select print on one side okay you can also select specific page maybe only page one okay so now this document we're going to print only page one and on only page one select print There we go. So we're going to print this document now. Only page one. So now this is the document we printed. Okay, single page, only page one. This one we printed double sided, one and two in one paper. Okay. Now, the other thing I want to show you, another way to print document is for you to go to Image Garden okay go to the image garden on your computer so this is my image garden okay so go to this is the image garden go to start my image garden select start my image garden and it's opening up okay now the next thing to do you can also see print you select print go to, go to the side and look for the document you want to print Okay, these are the documents we want to print out. The next thing to do is select print. Okay, go to the file on top, select print. And now this printer is getting ready. Okay, so when is so now this is for image garden. So you need to have the document save. Okay, now the other thing you need to do is make sure you scroll down to select the printer, select correct printer and select print here we go so this document now is printing from image garden This is the document we printed out from Image Garden. You can also